Today I'll be meeting with Cameron Sologi of Il Vinaya Restaurant. So Cameron, you could have chosen any place to locate your restaurant. Why'd you choose downtown Mesa? Well, we wanted to create a casual family environment, an environment where people could come and spend a long time and, and just relax with friends and kind of a European dining experience. So we were looking for a very large restaurant where we wouldn't have to turn people every 45 minutes. Uh, and beyond that, we wanted to have uh, art and culture. So wine is art, food is art, and we wanted to bring that and tie it all in together. So we've created an artistic environment here in the restaurant with the floors, with the writing on the walls, with the decor, and with the art and the food. We just felt downtown Mesa was a great match because of the art and cultural centers down here. Cameron, what would you like people to know about your cuisine? Well, that we're really American food. The name Il Vinaio is Italian for the wine merchant, but we're not necessarily an Italian restaurant. We're more of American cuisine. We start with the freshest herbs, fresh vegetables, fresh meats and poultry. Everything's cooked fresh here daily. Even our breakfast, everything's cooked fresh for breakfast. Well, we were really lucky to get our executive chef, Patrick Bull. He was executive chef at the Roaring Fork for nine years. He also worked at the Phoenician for three years, and he's opened many of the trendy Scottsdale restaurants right now. We have a wine bar that's actually shaped like a wine bottle. It's very comfortable and casual, like I said before. We have a very unique, eclectic wine list, practically 65 bottles of wine, all boutique wines, wines that pair well with food. So we've got a real foodies wine list. So somebody who doesn't have experience with wine need not feel afraid to come in here and and try out some wines you can you can guide them through that people who have fears of of new wines and new flavors definitely don't need to fear that we have a sommelier here at all times who can help guide people through their wine choices we have some entry level wines that are not intimidating all the way up to hundred dollar bottles of wine so we can find the wine that's best for you so we actually will be changing our menu seasonally three times a year and it really dovetails into what we're trying to do with the restaurant. We're really trying to create a, a breadth of experiences for people from all the different foods to the different exotic wines that we have and even the microbrews that we have that we'll regularly change up. So let's talk specifically about some of your cuisine. Well we've created a lot of fresh foods that go well with wine. And we understand sometimes people don't want a big heavy meal. So we've created a cheese platter and a share platter. Many of these uh, organically grown fruits and vegetables are grown local. We've got some amazing cheeses here. We've got a creamy blue cheese. We've got a drunken goat cheese that's actually cured in wine. We've got some soprasada sausage. We've got a spicy sausage. We've got a uh, sweet sausage. We've got some roasted vegetables. All of these are gonna pair incredibly well with either red wines or white wines. Looks delicious. So the bread salad contains organically grown tomatoes that are grown here locally, as well as mozzarella cheese balls, red onion, and freshly baked bread croutons that are baked here in Mesa. And for dessert, we've got a fresh blueberry tart here with sour cream and cream cheese on the bottom of the pastry. So there's not a lot of sweetness to the cream, but you get the sweetness in the berries. These are all fresh blueberries. Very, very light. We change our desserts up every week. So we usually have a choice of two or three desserts. There's always a chocolate one available. and. And maybe let's touch on some of your events that you're having here. Uh, you have a variety of... We have a variety of events going on all the time. We have wine tastings, we have live jazz, we have other types of live entertainment here as well. We've got a wine pairing dinner every month, and then we've got our second Friday in downtown Mesa where we have uh, arts and crafts and all kinds of events going on in downtown Mesa on Main Street. We're open breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So we open every day at 6 a.m. We serve breakfast and lunch until 3 p.m. and then we close down to flip the restaurant, put the linens on the table, and then at 4 o'clock we open our wine bar and at 5 o'clock we're open for dinner. Thank you, Cameron. If you'd like more information, please visit ilvenio.com.